Hi friends! Welcome back. Let's get this Canadian tuxedo show on the road. <laughs> <laughs> can I have your phone? Yeah. Thank you. You sure can. Okay, so this is bonus bonus episode. We are answering the rest of your questions and giving advice. And let's get started. Let's see here. I was like, ooh, I text you did. Me did. <laughs> I'm like, me did. <laughs> I knew what you meant. Okay. So my wife discovered that I keep a calendar that reminds her to ask about stuff going on in her life. And she found out about it. She basically thinks I'm an asshole for keeping track of it, but I don't really think it's that bad to set reminders. Thoughts. What's the problem? His wife, this is more of like, am I the asshole? His wife found out that he sets calendar reminders to ask her about stuff that's going on in her life. She's mad about that? Yeah. She doesn't deserve him. Ugh. Leave her for, leave oh her God, leave and come, him. come to me. Yeah. <laughs> come to Chelsea. I would that love that. Is genius. Genius. I put, I mean, I put reminders on my phone all the time. I mean, I, there's always birthdays. There's always anniversaries. Yeah. There's always like, oh, I, I gotta pay this bill. I gotta call someone so I don't have to pay this bill. Right. Like, there's... But I've never thought like, to use it for like social things. Yeah. Or like, like, hey, how's that going with your coworker? Yeah. Oh, That's a good call. That is smart. Uh huh. I'm sorry. You're mad that your husband is smart. Yeah. <laughs> sorry. No, you married an <laughs> asshole. I mean, at least on this circumstance. Yeah, I think that's smart. Okay. Would you be upset if your husband pulled a JB at your big event? What's a JB? A Justin Bieber. What does that mean? You, he sh you show up looking hot, and he shows up in sweatpants. Oh, God. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> that's, I think I know your answer. <laughs> tell, tell me. That's the equivalent of house slippers. Oh. Oh, wow. I didn't think it was that bad. Mother fuck you're an extension of me. And if I look good, now if I don't look good, fair. Okay. But if I look fly and I might look the best in the whole thing and you're scrunchy ass, like you can't, you got to bring your best A game. You cannot just stroll like it's a, because I was raised looking good is a compliment to either the person or the circumstance or both. Right? I will get dressed up for my hair people. I will get dressed up for other things that I can't think of right now. And it's a sign of respect. You are disrespecting me if you're like, I don't care. The guy I was married to, he would roll up in sweatpants and it irked me. <sighs> made me angry. <laughs> I see that. <laughs> Um, so if you look good and he rolls up in like gym shorts, you're okay with it? No. Don't even lie. Okay. This, no. I, no. <laughs> Baloney. You need to tell me if moon's over my hand via the flight of the Rockies and you looked all good in that red dress uh -huh. and he roll up in like joggers, you'd be okay with it? No. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. I'm just saying he, if it's my thing. At my event, and it's all about me. He doesn't have to roll up in like the best suit that he owns, but not sweatpants. Like an in between. If it was a casual thing, I'd live. Oh, you mean like a so fired event, and he rolled up in like joggers? Yeah. Okay, I guess that's all right. Yeah. Like if they're like an accessory to the event. Yeah. Sure. I'm like, Bye. it's not about you. It's about us. So all right. as long as long as you don't roll up in sweatpants. <laughs> I mean, they'd be cute sweatpants. No, you know what I mean. Okay, I think we're on the same page. Okay. How do you get rid of booty cramps? I don't even know what you're saying. Like. <laughs> the fuck's a booty cramp? I think, like, when your booty, like, cramps up. I don't have that. Like, ever. Ever? Never. I don't even have, I've never had it. <laughs> or, like, I don't know, with, you're working out very hard and your booty cramps up? No. Or just, like, in life, your booty cramps up? No. <laughs> Is this a you problem? Yeah. Because I was saying, I worked yesterday, I was like, my booty's like cramping up. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have that problem. <laughs> I, maybe I was sitting for too long. Maybe, yeah. I guess, I like know. shitty chairs. Yeah, it was a shitty chair. And I have shitty chairs at my work, and I'm just like, oh, 
this is uncomfortable. So you end up in, like, walking around. I walked so long yesterday. I walked, like, an hour and a half, and then another 45 minutes after that. That's more walking than I've done in, like, months. That's me walking. <laughs> yeah, that is. It's addictive, isn't it? Not really. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> okay, what was the best day so far this year? Today. Oh. Why? I don't know. We're on fire today. We are on fire today. And I just get such a chuckle that we showed up in the same outfit <laughs> without even planning it. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's pretty funny. Um, let's see. Yeah, my birthday was also one of the best days. The Chainsmokers concert I went to. Uh, that was, like, one of the best days. Oh, what about our like, first time going to Whiskey Row? Oh, yeah. <laughs> that might be. That's the best day. Yeah, that was the best day. Oh, yeah. you and I spending my birthday together? Yeah. That was a magical day. That's a magical but day. But that first night at <laughs> Whiskey Row together... I think that was last year, technically. When was it? My birthday last year. Was the first time we went to Whiskey Row? Like, no. Like, sometime around my birthday. Oh, it was? I feel like it was. I don't know, oh, maybe not. because we went with Connor, and I wasn't con oh. friends with Connor until New Year's. Oh, okay. It was cold out. Oh, yeah, it was cold out. Because the first time I... No, it was this year. Okay. Okay, so yeah, that was very magical. That was a good time. That was oh, a good time. I had a really good time at the, um, oh, this was last year, at the concert. Which one? The one I went to with Jen, but that was in November. Oh. Um, hmm. I had a really good time recently. Oh, that 4th <laughs> of July concert when I was in Boulder. Oh, yeah. That might have been my personal favorite day of the year. Yeah. Okay. That's a good one. That was a good one. Um, the day I, I sold my practice, that was actually a magical day. <laughs> <laughs> and then the shittiest oh, day, like 24 hours later. <laughs> oh, but... <laughs> oh. but if there's highs, highs, there's low lows because you don't know a high, high without that Golly. very big pendulum swing. Oh, man. <laughs> Um, okay, what's your favorite hobby? <sighs> Working out. <laughs> um, this is becoming a new favorite hobby of mine, is teaching me how to do makeup. Yeah. Yeah. How does it look? It looks so good. Is it the best it's ever looked? Yeah. It's the best it's ever looked that I've done. That it. you've done. Yeah. Without my help. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks. I'd say like two days ago was the best it's ever looked. When we did it together. Oh. Yeah. Well, then I'll continue to practice because I didn't know. I was like, this is going by so much faster than it should be. Yeah. And actually, I think it took so long when we did it together because we're talking and. I had my oh. nose done. Yeah. Do you think that's the only difference? Um, I think there's not as much product on. Yeah. I would say your nose isn't as contoured as I did it before. No, I didn't know how to do that. Yeah. That's where I was like, oh, boy. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Hold um, up. <laughs> that, that's your favorite hobby because you've been helping me buy makeup. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I love everything makeup related. I love trying new makeup trends. And I'm going to try, a, like, an underpainting technique. Which is what? <laughs> Which is where you can either do it just on the um, – on the primer or put a very light foundation on and then you put your blush on and your bronzer on and then you go back with your concealer and kind of like go over it a little bit so it looks like the blush is peeking through and then you can go on top with a powder blush just to brighten it back up again so it, it's supposed to be more of like a natural look yeah so i'm gonna try that that's very exciting any makeup related thing that's like my favorite hobby <laughs> It is. And I'm glad that I didn't do it intentionally, but it only makes sense because I'm like, I'm meeting Lindsay where she is most happy. Yeah. And now we can share that together. That is correct. <laughs> Wait, what's your favorite hobby? I don't have one. What's my favorite hobby? Podcasting. Yeah. Yeah. Because I'm not fully paid yet. Therefore, yeah. it's still a hobby by someone's Same. standards. So I guess that's my other favorite hobby. Uh, what's my other favorite hobby? Um, I don't know. Do you consider walking your dogs a hobby? No, that's like the equivalent of like, I love working out. <laughs> that's like life. Yeah. Um, I swear to God that sewing was one of my favorite hobbies. I was going to say sewing. And I swear to God I am going to start again soon. 
now. I just need to give you a project to do and then you'll do it. So the project I really want to do is start teaching myself from like the, from like get the textbook out and start like teaching myself from page one. Mm, yeah. Kind of like how I'm retraining myself to play piano. Exactly. Page one. Yeah. I really do like sewing. I don't know. I just get uh, the imposter syndrome. I have no reason. There's no reason not to. There's no reason not to. Like, no one's grading you. No one gives a fuck. No. No one's judging you. Like, no. it's all... You just do it here. And the last time I did something, it was pretty awesome. Yeah. My jacket that you made me? Yeah, it was really good. Yeah, it's so cute. Anyway. Okay. Oh, and I like making tiny houses. It's my other... Oh, yeah. Yeah. Totally. I guess I have hobbies. You do have hobbies. You have a lot of them. Yeah. Huh. Pickleball's <laughs> also becoming the next one. You've got tons of hobbies. Yeah. Okay, well, dancing, I, night clubbing. Yep. Oh, Red. I better go do another hobby right now. Like what? Eating. Eating. I'm starving. Yeah. All right. Okay. Uh, thanks for tuning in. Make sure you are subscribed to our YouTube channel so you never miss any of our episodes. And also subscribe wherever you get your podcasts on Apple and Spotify, Stitcher, iTunes, Radios, iHeartRadio, blah 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 blah. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. <laughs>